Ellie wanted to go into the swamp. So teams are two. We'll make it back through the swamp. Doug and Terry, nip round to the five acre and work your way back up through the gully. But keep an eye out. Could be anywhere. OK, let's go. Hi. Hi. We have to talk later. If that kid's a goner, they'll drain that overgrown puddle for sure. Can't lose. I thought you had a bit of a thing for Mrs. Elliot. Not with the family. Bad enough having a brother. What? Is it too much bother? Okay, mate. Yeah, keep me posted. I'll call you shortly. Yeah, over and out. Nothing yet. Oh, Mrs. Elliot, wouldn't you rather wait at the farm? There's no way you'll be in there, but I may as well. What's that? Oh, it's the old command post. When the airfield was here, civil defence keeps it up. Bones broken, as far as I can see. It's all right, son. Come on. Let's get him out of here. Thanks, everyone. Swamp. It's dangerous. He's very lucky. Yes. Have you seen Ronnie? I think he and Gretchen went off together. But don't worry, he's no trouble. Well, tell him I'm looking for him. Sure. Are you sure you weren't polishing it? I didn't touch it, and I didn't turn it over. It saved my life. I fell slowly, as though I was cushioned at night, like a force field. It knew Ronnie, so did the daisy rod. When you tried falling that far, it heard me screaming. You know those dreams you had about falling through space in something metal? Brass? Have you had them? Yeah. There's a drawer of this in one of my uncle's old books. And a warning. Tipple. Forbidden. It can't be bad if it saved my life. Yes, but why? And where does that boy fit in? Bevis. I saw something sort of brass where I found him. Did you? Come on. Well, we can at least find out if it's... If it's what? Part of this. It might just be something off the farm. Yeah, 
For example? Well, we won't know till we have a look, will we? Have you always been like this? Yep. And I'm too hard to change. Ronnie must learn at his own speed. You can't force him. He thinks a tapu is just a no trespassing sign. He'll learn with guidance. Are you going to tell him the old legends? He's not ready yet. It will help him understand why we don't use the swamp. Mm. something for the lad. Shh, shh, shh. Will he be all right? Just rest and no interruptions. Easter egg. Chocolate. That's the main thing. Kids love it. Yeah, well, thanks, Mr. Mitchell. Herbert. And don't worry about this land thing. I'll sort it out. We make a good team, eh? Yes, well, bye for now, Herbert. dry land. We take nothing else from the swamp. Just to the edge. Is that all right? All right. But no further to sort everything out, OK? <coughs> Need a tractor to shift it. Uncle Donald's got a tractor. Your Uncle Donald is going to lend us the tractor. I'm going to ask him. Hi, uh, yep. And you can drive one? Oh, I can drive my parents' car, and I tracked as much the same. I'm 12 years old, and I understand engines. I'm careful, I won't go fast. And I can't think of a single reason in the world why you wouldn't say yes. No. N-O, no. Taste all right? Delicious. Biddy couldn't program a computer. Well, looks like we're stuck now. Should we have a lunch now? Why? Make sure we finish before Uncle Donald. I've got a little plan. Oh, no.
The other parts must fit onto this. All we're going to do is have a look, right? Yeah, but we can't just leave it here. Here, here, here. There. Don't shoot it. Where'd you go? Might as well push it. Come on. I'm pushing. Glad I don't live next door to you. We need to get this inside and then go and see Bevis. Bevis, Bevis, it's all right, darling. I'm here. I'm here. Bevis, now. Why did you do that? The Dogon legends are true. We did have alien visitors. Space probes. And one of them is still here. It's broken up and buried in the swamp. Or was. Maybe it is, Gretchen. But that's where it stays. This is Tapu, remember? When I touched that base, it was like an electric shock. It was reactivating. I think the day's world was calling it. It's part of the control system, I think. It can scan us, somehow make contact. Contact? With us? You had those dreams. 
falling through space. I've had them too. Must have repair circuits of some kind sending out signals. Why is it making contact? I think it needs us to put it back together. What? What if it's dangerous? Dangerous? It saved my life. You don't know anything about it. Anything. I found it. I know it's the most important scientific discovery of all time. Please. Before you decide anything, can I see them? I had the dreams too. Please? He's part of it too, Ronnie. What are we part of? Communication from an alien civilization to us. I'm scared too, Ronnie. Okay. Yeah, well, after tomorrow, we stick those bits back where they belong. In the swamp. Thanks. Tomorrow morning. See ya. Bye. Well, I've just been inspecting some vandalism. You should choose your friends more carefully, sweetheart. No. It was Mitchell. I heard him talking about it last night when I sneaked out. I think he's doing some more. Tomorrow. What? And he's got me sunglasses to leave them there to be found as evidence. Mrs. Elliot phoned. She's sorting it out with Constable Willis. It wasn't me. I never thought it was. You like it here, Ronnie? I feel as though I belong. You do belong, boy. <sighs> Something in that swamp, not made of wood or stone or anything natural. It is not for us. Let it stay there. Let it never be seen. Come on. We've got all tomorrow. It's not for us. Does that mean it's bad? Wrong? It means it's not for us. The land holds it. The land should keep it safe. Come on. I uh, had to get them away, Ronnie. Why does it do that? No need to be upset. There's a theory. Some whiz kid's been messing around with the wire and makes a change from horse napping, eh? You can't blame me for everything. Gretchen. Come on, sausage. Smile. Smile? Good night. Night, sausage. been a long day. So, no sitting up. Thank you.
Thank <laughs> you. 